What's up, guys? It's Killer B here from HookahPro.com, bringing you a tobacco review. Um, as you may have heard in some of my other reviews recently, um, all of my tobacco I have around here is getting a little bit uh, overdone for me. I've smoked a, a lot of it uh, quite a few times now, and it's just really not doing it for me. So I wandered down to my local smoke shop, uh, High Tide Pipes and Tobacco, um, and the nice lady there uh, sold me some Leolina. Uh, as you can see there, it's an Escondorani apple. Um, it's, if you're not familiar with Escondorani apple flavors, they're generally speaking, uh, a really straightforward apple flavor. None of the anise, like you usually find in, uh, the Bahraini apples and the double apples and such. Um, and I've been looking for a good regular apple flavor for a while now. Um, I had AF, Alfaka that is, uh, Golden Escondorani Apple a while back. Ordered it from hookahdrawn.com, and that stuff just wasn't doing it for me. Um, I had it had an okay flavor. If I wanted absolutely no smoke whatsoever, like anything more than just like a little tiny itty bitty wisp, uh, it just got really really irritating to my throat, and it wasn't really pleasant at all. Um, the cut on this stuff, you can kind of see it right there. Um, it's pretty choppy. Um, there's quite a few stems in this package. There was it's a 50 gram package, and there was four pretty large stems. Not like a big tree trunk kind of thing, but uh, certainly uh, too large to be p putting in your bowl for the most part. Um, I'd compare this to like an Al Fokker cut. Um, maybe just a little bit more uh, juicy than an Al Fokker. Um, the smell on it, it smells just like an apple, um, absolutely no spices in there whatsoever, no cinnamon, no anise, um, and I do not believe this is dyed, it looks pretty natural to me, um, I have it loaded into a vortex bowl up here, two chronic hookah natural coals, a single layer of aluminum foil, and smoking it out of my 34 inch KM red double pair with my KM red leather hose. As you may have noticed, this is my mint hose, and I should have switched it out, but it's not ghosting, so I'm not going to worry about it. Um, I had this bowl going for probably almost 20 minutes now. Uh, see how it's smoking. Let me rotate my coals real quick. Um, I will tell you right now that this tobacco, going into it, I wasn't too excited. I have some experience with Leolina. It's where my roots as a hookah smoker started, really. Um, smoking Leolina and Alfaker tobacco. Um, and like I said, going into it, I wasn't too, uh, wasn't super excited about it. Uh, it was never a really poor quality tobacco, like a Prince Molasses, or, um, what was the other really terrible one I had? I can't remember the name of the other really god-awful tobacco I had, but, uh, it's kind of like a middle-of-the-road kind of thing, and, but I'm actually pretty pleasantly surprised with it. As you can see, I'm getting pretty decent clouds. Um, not gigantic, but pretty nice. Um, the flavor towards the beginning of the bowl was a little bit better than it is right now. It's got a little bit of a... Like I burnt the tobacco just a tiny bit um, earlier on. And I can still kind of get a little bit of that, but I'm not sure if that's a, the tobacco or if it actually was just a, a user error. Um, the flavor is really natural. I'm digging it quite a lot. Um, as far as the straight apple goes. I mean, it's not fantastic. I'm not going to be ranting and raving about it like I was with like a hookah hookah lemonade or a uh, miso watermelon, but it is a solid tobacco. Again, it is straight apple. There's no spices, and if that's what you're looking for, 
and you don't want to risk a bad batch of alfacker. Alfacker. Uh, I would definitely recommend going out on a limb and just trying a little 50 gram sample of this. I don't think you'll be too disappointed. Um, it has a little bit of a lingering taste to it. Uh, and the smoke seems like it's a little, I don't know, denser, thicker, like feeling texture wise. The smoke is actually pretty nice as far as tricks go. So if that's your thing, no concerns in that area. Um, I'm going to give this tobacco a 7 out of 10, maybe just a little bit higher, but not much. Um, solid tobacco, do not be afraid of picking it up if you're worried about Leia leading it, uh, given it's uh, less than stellar general conception, but uh, yeah, definitely consider picking it up. I do believe it is a wash tobacco, I'm not really getting a buzz off of it and I haven't eaten in a while. I don't really remember getting a buzz off Leia Lina in the past. Um, other than that, I would just like to say thank you to hookahpro.com for uh, enabling me and my hookah passion. Uh, if you're not a member already, I highly recommend you sign up. Uh, great web community for anything hookah. Definitely my go-to place over the other sites. Um, yeah, pretty much all I got for you today, guys. It's Killer B here. Signing out, I'm going to continue this bowl, finish it off, and then probably go back to my ridiculously boring day. Peace!